in season, boys. Today is a pivotal game. We have a chance to pull off an undefeated season as we're sitting at 4-0 and right now. So one more win. We are in the playoffs. Three losses on booted. So if I somehow pulled the Philadelphia Eagles and ended the season real weak, we actually wouldn't make the playoffs. But dude, I have never felt better. We got a 93 overall offense, a 93 overall defense. We have not lost a game. We forced two rage quits. And I gotta walk you through this team because I love so many parts of this team. We got Joe Flacco at quarterback. We got Jameer Gibbs, one of my favorite players in the league at halfback. Got our limited prestige Jamar Chase and our limited prestige Trent Williams. By the way, sorry if team of the year dropped. It hasn't dropped as I'm recording this. We got Geno Atkins, a surprisingly good left guard out of position. Marquise Pouncey at center. Kevin Zeitler at right guard. And Blake Freeland. We're working on it. Limited Gronk at tight end with a backup of 95 playoffs George Kittle, who's also an amazing tight end. And we picked up a nostalgia legend who also had an absolutely insane game last game. We only played like two quarters and this dude had 115 yards and two touchdowns. He was going off. Would have loved to see his end stat line, but we didn't need it. Clearly we didn't need it. I am no longer going to use his X Factor though. He does get Ankle Breaker for free. Ankle Breaker is a very specific ability though. You get a high fake out rate on a skill move post catch. It's not like Freight Train. Freight Train is so good because you simply break a tackle. No matter what you're doing, no matter how you got touched, you break the tackle. So I think it's worth it to put Freight Train on Jameer Gibbs, even though I have to activate it in order to reap the benefits. Should be easier now because we have Mike Allstock. 94 overall fullback, the highest overall fullback in the game, and he's a monster. He's fast. He gets out there. He throws great blocks, so my I-form run should be even better. Defensively, of course, we've got our prestige Ray Lewis. We've got our white boy pass coverage linebackers, Pete Werner, Logan Wilson, and even Isaiah McDuffie. Got Derwin James, Sean Taylor. Sean Taylor truly proving to be just one of the best players in this game. It is absurd the shit he does. PS2 had a pick. Devin Witherspoon's been great. Devontae Adams. And then our crazy D-line. It's been a hell of a season, dude. It's been a hell of a season. There are still a few things we can upgrade, but I'm not gonna lie, boys. We are cooking right now. Let's start out with a right tackle, please. Maybe we can get any single player in the league, but they must be exactly this age. Hey, I'm 25. Sit there. Sit there. Guys, I was born in 1998. Am I not just an old piece of shit? Yeah. Which is crazy because my girlfriend was born in 2010. No, 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 2002. 2002. Here's a really good option. We actually almost were able to pick him up last episode. Christian Dara saw. Dare, I saw your nuts in my mouth. Born June 2nd, 1999. Puts him at the age of 24. Super good left tackle, where we obviously have Trent Williams, so we're gonna move him over to right tackle. And that completes our offensive line. 95 strength, 95 run block, 96 run block finesse. He's a run block guy. Maybe a decent discounted ability. Zero AP natural talent. We're getting all line abilities. All right, Dara saw is in at right tackle. He's down to a 92, but still amazing card. Dude, the offensive line looks amazing now. Williams, Atkins, Pouncey, Zeitler, Darisaw. We can pass, we can run, we can do whatever we want on offense. Takes us to our second wheel spin of the episode. I kind of want to get Steve Smith Sr. out of there. He's got 87 speed. He's got old man legs. Do I take him out for himself? Dude, Steve Smith would actually be such a sick player to have on the team. Ultimate Legend 96s. So the 97s are the limiteds for Ultimate Legends. Everything else is a 96. We just saw um, Marino last game. I'm not entirely sure what the options are, so we should take a look first. Edgerin James, not gonna happen. Ozzy Newsome, not gonna happen. Terrell Suggs. Damn, he would probably be really good. That's kind of what I'm looking at. Cromartie would be nasty. There's Geno Atkins D-tackle, but... Ooh. Ooh, Upshaw. Steve Smith Sr. Dude, I love how the Ultimate Legend cards look. They look so sick. He's a 5'9 wide receiver. Smith was 5'9 made it in the National Football League. I love that. 94 and pretty much everything else, if not better. Great change of direction. Ball carry vision. Stiff arm spin. 94 juke is huge. 89 break tackle is insane for being 5'9. He's a little, a little tank. Dude, this is our... Dude, our wide receiver core is so cool. Tory Holt, Steve Smith, Jamar Chase. Makes me really happy. Hopefully he gets a 0 AP ability as well. I'm not sure if every ultimate legend does no so route tech mid out and third down they're all discounted but nothing's for free we're just gonna we're just gonna what did i say last time we're just gonna raw dog him and hope he doesn't get pregnant god that's a good one matt it's a good one matt steve smith you are coming out for steve smith i don't know i'd rather have a six foot tall wide receiver at wide receiver one so all three of my wide receivers got 95 speed halfbacks got 95 speed we've seen joe flacco take off when needed all right boys everything is looking good only thing i'll do here is bolster the linebacker that is, if I get a choice, 
It's a survival mini game. 70. Oh, okay. So we should have a choice. I have to get gold or otherwise I'm not going to get a linebacker that I really want here. So first things first, we go into mini games. We can choose a survival mini game. I'm going to play as a random team. I'm just going to scroll and then stop. Excellent team to get. So there's only two survival mini games. There's backfield survival. There's backfield survival home base. Gosh, I'm trying to remember how I did this one in the past. I've clearly gotten gold on it before. We get 75,000 coins per tier. Backfield survival against the dolphins. Wish me luck. Let's go, D Swift. I know I can get them stuck, and I know you get points for how long you last. Ha. Huh. Nice. My girlfriend wishes I got points for how long I lasted. All right. This is a good start. I'm trying to remember where that 500 is, though. So progressively more defenders come out. We don't even have bronze yet. Oh, my God. He's kind of fast, bro. Who is that? He's hauling dick. Is that Wilkins? Give me it. 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 I got to get them stuck. All right. Let's hold them here for a second while we figure out what we want to do here with this stamina. How does that stamina go? It bounces, huh? Okay. We got to go up the sideline here. Don't catch me. Yes! He missed. Huge. Where's the 500 now? Is that Javon Holland back there? Dude, whoever this... D. Lyman is? Dude, his buddy's hauling dick. I do not like it. No! Oh, no. I thought he was going to get stuck on that tire. No! I got silver. I honestly got pretty close to gold. If I had grabbed that last 500, we had a shot. So I get silver tier. That's 150,000 coins to spend on one player. I am going the linebacker route. It's just 225 would have really pushed us into like the 94, 95 overall territory. We're probably going to get a 93 here. Dude, you know what's funny? This is actually a perfect opportunity to use one of the craziest cards in this game. I elected not to use him before because at the time I thought he was too OP. But he's outdated enough to where I'm going to do this. I need three overall hits. Harold Carmichael left outside linebacker for 120,000 coins. I guarantee if you play Madden 24 Ultimate Team, you've seen this Carmichael. I still see it all the time. Six foot eight, 93 speed with three Lurk Artist. So we're actually going to save one AP and we can distribute that somewhere on the defense since he gets this for free. And he'll go in for Big Logan Wilson, who's my left outside. That would mean we get to keep Pete Werner too. And I do love me. I do love me a good Pete Werner. So Carmichael comes in, boosted to a 94. I can actually move Logan Wilson to my MLB 2. So he still has, you know, he's still getting reps. All right, so we activate Carmichael, and now we have one AP that we can use somewhere. Who do we use that on? Spoon? Do you have a one AP pick artist? Do you have a zero AP pick artist? Yeah, there's legitimately nothing I can do with one AP other than I could activate Logan Wilson. Oh, no, he's... All right, I guess Logan Wilson. So no matter what linebackers, no matter what sets, we have all Lurk artists at our linebackers. All right, gentlemen, offense is good to go. Six players with abilities. And on defense, it's damn near the entire round roster. And honestly, like, I really like this balancing they did because offense is so powerful in Madden 24, but you're really limited on your abilities, whereas defense is pretty tough. But damn, you can load up some abilities. This is crazy. It's just at a 94 overall. I can't believe this. We're actually rocking an almost God Squad in Wheel of Mutton. We will absolutely be rocking a full God Squad come the playoffs. A win right here takes me to the Super Bowl. And I need my challenge wheel, Matt. Damn it. It's gonna get hectic. I'm spinning the challenge wheel. As I see the top three, this is a Wheel of Mutt Cardinal Sin. Come on, baby, the challenge wheel is 30 fantasy points with my hat back. He's got Ray, Jordan Love, Chris Jones. We got Flacco, Ray, and Devante. Come on, baby. All right, champ, let's play ball, buddy. Please don't. Please don't. Actually, no, I would prefer you quit right now so I can play another game. All right, J-Love, what do you got? I'm on Nick Bosa. I'm not supposed to be. Second and one. Dude, having Carmichael in here is so nice. Yo, my secondary user option is just a freak show. Staying on Carmichael. Such a disgusting user. Six foot eight. Dude, if you thought Ray Lewis was jumping with Lurk Artist, get ready. Does he want that corner out? No, he throws middle. Dude, he's... I have never seen this offense. Let's switch up our defense. Oh, I still have Cromartie at my slot corner. That's not right. That should be Derek Stingley. Oh, come on! It don't matter! I don't need Carmichael! Oh shit! Get the fuck off of me! Jordan loves dick! Let's go, baby! Woo! Holy shit, I didn't think I was gonna get to that! That was a hell of a run there! Two point conversion! Jamar! No! Darn it! Dude, I suck ass at two point conversions. I'm so trash. Dude, low key, I do need 30 fantasy points for my halfbacks. So I probably should have taken that out the one and let Jimmy run it in, but we got a lot of football left here. Hutchinson? Why is Aiden Hutchin- Why is Silver Aiden Hutchinson in? What is going on with all of my substitutions? Where's J- Bagged by Devontae Adams. What is going on all of a sudden? Now my, now my rush D tackle is Aiden Hutchinson? I'm on Jalen Carter and I don't want to be. No, don't let him, Carmichael. 
Jordan Love gets around it. Well played. I'm going to send the blitz here. My favorite blitz in the game. Sam Will. Sam will sack your ass. Don't sleep on Pete Werner, bro. I might take Pete Werner all the way to the Super Bowl. Even if an opportunity arises, I might just do it. Slip screen? No. Just misread slip screen. Oh! It's in trips, tight end. I'm gonna go on Werner here. I'm trying to bait out a little seam beater here. I want him to think it's open. Shit. Too deep. Fourth and 10. It's about to be all over. All right, first and 10. I think we just start stacking Gibbs fantasy points. It's PPR. Beautiful start. Second and three. Let's go. Same thing, other side. He's got at least three fantasy points now. He's got 11 yards and two receptions. All right, now we go nuclear. Send him yard. Actually, so grateful that was bad ball because that would have probably been intercepted. Not certain that I can run this. Oh yeah, I do. I pouncy. Marquise pouncy with secure protector. Still able to get four, but but dude, I don't know. Chris Jones still made a really good play there. All right, third and six. Gotta stop worrying about Gibbs and just pick this up. Oh Gronk, what a laser! I love you, Flacco. Hell of a throw. Jameer, 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 Jameer. Juke left. Ah! Damn it! Six to zero at the end of the first, dude. I don't know what it's like to be losing. I feel like I've just been taking handle of every game this season of Lamar. All right, same route combo. We got that post, and then we got Tory Holt. Uh oh. Tory Holt. Tory Holt. Tory Holt. No blitz. It's there, but can I make a move? Go, Jameer. Hey. Down to the two. Let's go, Jameer. Hey, I'm gonna punch this in. He has inside stuff, but we have secure protector. Yeah. No, but I don't have secure protector on him. Hey, we got a yard, though. Do I try it again? Fuck it. We ball. Fuck it. We ball. We ball. We don't ball. Fourth and goal. I'm going for it. Jameer Gibbs wheel route. If not, Jamar Chase. Oh, shit. Jameer Gibbs. He's there. Caught. End zone. That might have been 15 fantasy points on that one drive. Let's get him the octopus. No. Jameer is out. Just let Gronk body that, man. Absolutely bodied. You literally just got posted up. No way. Jordan Love is in piss right now. That's a dot. All right, shit. Sorry, Jordan Love. I know I was talking all that. It was a good ball. There is nothing open. Dude, you just can't be throwing that. Sertan got both feet down! Dude, I'm not even gonna lie to you. I'm not even gonna lie to you. This was, that was a Mickey Mouse game. That's such an early rage quit. I'm not counting it. I'm gonna go into another game. That game doesn't count as far as Wheelamut's concerned, but I am gonna open one pack. That's basically my reward. Basically my reward for forcing a rage quit. I'm gonna go with an Ultimate Legends pack. See if we can maybe pull some sauce. 87 Gene Upshaw, 90 Terrell Suggs. Honestly, these are just great players to have on the bench in case I prestige or pack a punch. So happy to have them. Welcome to the team. Let's move on to the real deal. Blacko Ray Devante. What do you got, baby? Give me some comp. Now that's some comp. Let's go. Starting with the kickoff, Texans versus Saints in Saints Stadium. What do you got, Saints? Gosh, it's weird. I feel like I always have home field advantage. Jamal Williams will take seven yards. He looks so much like Kamara, like in Madden. I totally thought that was Kamara on the Saints. Although I suppose Jamal Williams is a Saint too, isn't he? I'm gonna hop on Derwin here. Any opportunity to use your Derwin, I love to take. Oh, a little RPO. That is a really nice RPO. They keep switching up the defenses. I don't want to get stagnant. Escape route out of Gronk. I bottled that. He wanted to throw that so bad. I mirrored that shit. Let's go. I don't see the escape route very often. All right, we're bringing out the blitz. My favorite blitz. It's a great time to use it when he's got to pick up a lot of yards. Second and 23. It's absolutely nothing. Now we got to come out of it. You run that thing too many times in a row, they will burn you. Let's go cover six, show four. Yo, he's got the Gronk that I use. He's got Vanguard Gronk. Oh, he runs the ball, and we blitz Witherspoon at the best time. Fourth and 26. Hell of a defensive rally right there. Let's go, boys. It's the same challenge wheel, so 30 fantasy points with my halfback. Now we just play ball. I'm going up to Gronk. <gasps> Glitchy! You always got Julius Peppers. I hate that Julius Peppers. Those are always such a sketchy throw, but nobody's user will ever commit to that. All right, first and 10. Hey, we got all stop for a reason, right? There's Mikey boy. <laughs> oh, dude, I forgot. Gronk is my slot wide receiver. Dude, I have all of my, all my shit is messed up. 
Let's go Jameer right in the middle. How do we do? That's so crucial. You can't just like lose downs in games like this. I don't know why that got messed up, but that really sucks. I gotta go into my depth chart and mess with some stuff here. I need Steve Smith as my slot wide receiver, number one. <laughs> Are you serious? That was going to be such a good game. All because I went to make adjustments? Well, at least I can make legitimate adjustments here. Slot wide receiver, Steve Smith. Slot corner, Devin Witherspoon. And now we need to reactivate Devin Witherspoon's free pick artist because when you sub him into slot corner, it deactivates it. I learned that the hard way. You guys might remember that from season two. All right, game three. I ain't, I ain't counting that shit. I ain't counting that shit. Let's go. Black Ray and Devontae. Something about that top three is just scaring people today. Ray, Jair, Doug, I know you know how to play ball play with me first and ten dougie fresh first pass into kyle pitts for eight yards stingley's in now yep yep probably runs this he sure does damn he's got secure protector so jalen carter's not gonna be the crazy dominant force that he usually is oh we finally got the comp that we asked for boys oh he doesn't have secure protector how did we not blow that up maybe a good double team i have this bagged I have everything bagged. God damn, Doug Williams is fast, and he got that ball off? All right, just stay in this. Stay in this. Second and ten. Could be a run, so I'm not going to guess bad. Oh, with a spoon! Don't you even think about quitting. You know you can play better than that. This team is out of its mind. This team is out of its mind. We can't even get scored on. First and ten. Take me to the edge. Ooh. Oh, he has no outsiders, doesn't he? He absolutely swam past Gronk. Yeah, that's no outsiders on Demarcus Lawrence. Yeah, that makes sense. Same challenge. Slow and steady wins the race. There's Torrey Holt in the middle. Great catch. Third and one. Third and one. There's Jameer Gibbs. What a play. Big juke. Oh, stay up, Jameer. Ooh, breaking the hit stick. First and 10. I think I can run the ball to the middle, but he has double no outsiders. Chris Jones has inside stuff. Okay, I have no idea if I can run this or not. I'm going to try it. Zone fake jet. I can. Pouncey gets to the second level. Seven yard rush, Jameer Gibbs. If we stay away from Chris Jones, we can do it. I don't think I can really I form stretch though. Uh, that's going to be really tough. We're not going to be able to do that all game. Give me, it's going to be a passing game. I got scared of his user, but I can still hit Jameer! Who can joke right? Take it in the end zone! That's how you get those fantasy points! That was a crazy throw, Joe Flacco. Oh, it could have been intercepted too. Huge, huge. Okay, I'm not going for two. I've been so pitiful going for two today. Look at this. Look at that throw, Flacco. All right, 7 0. I gotta piss like a racehorse. I'll be right back. Pin it. 7 0. Taking a piss did give me very bad field position. He starts on the 41. He's gotta be running the ball. After throwing a pick like that. Oh. Oh, that post is open. Pete Warner! You're getting the best blowjob of your life! No! Don't test my goat. Don't test my goat. They thought that because Pete Warner came out four months ago, that because he's a 90 overall and because nobody uses him, they thought they could test my goat. Dude, you're gonna keep leaving Jameer? I'm gonna go RPO zone peak here. I think, I think the RPOs like kind of negate the ability. Yeah, they do. They negate those abilities um, because the game doesn't register it as a true run play. So he didn't just blow up my block there. I'm going to try and do this anyway, even though he has no outsiders. Yeah, it worked. Get inside. Oh, that's, oh, the vision, the running back vision, cutting inside of his blocks. That doesn't get you amped up. You don't love, you don't love football. Mm, it's not there. I can hit this escape route, though, out of our backup tight end, George Kittle. Okay, I've got like a levels concept with post routes, which is really weird. Oh, shit. Did Chris Jones just bat that? I think Gronk is open, but I'm not going to stare it down. He was. Why am I getting all, why am I getting all anxious now? He's going to leave Steve Smith. Leave Steve Smith. Damn, Malik Hooker. Wow, three and out after we got down there. I don't know what happened to my offense, but it just deflated. I should have thrown the Gronk down. I don't know why I got all anxious and didn't throw that. Butker Prestige, by the way, was so insanely good. Not having to worry about that every season. 10 points and ball at half. We have been flawless on defense so far. He's in five wide bunch right. Don't. <sighs> Jalen Carter. Now he's forced to pass. I could send the blitz right now. I'm going to send Werner and Spoon. I just got to hope he's looking right side on his routes. Oh, shit. We could play. That was risky. Maybe a run play. I'm going on Derwin for the inside zone. It is a pass. Oh, I can get to this. I dare you. Let's go. 
Will Anderson! No, it's Jalen Carter again. Jalen, why is Jalen Carter my best pass rusher? I have two limiteds on either side of the ball, but Jalen Carter, 93 Christmas. It's the Christmas cards, dude. Pete Werner's of the world. They make the world go round. No, no, you're not hitting that disgusting ass. No, this is an all or nothing guy, bro. He didn't know how to just hand the damn ball off. Or maybe he does on third and 23. I'm going on Ray Ray. Any corner outs I need to worry about? Post. That got open at the last second, but my pass rush is just too good. It's fourth and 23 from the 21. He's going to go for this. And when he doesn't get it, he's going to rage quit. And that's going to be three wins in one episode of Wheel of Mud. Are you ready? I'm blitzing Spoon. I'm blitzing Ray. I'm on Pete Werner. No, I'm on Derwin. This is engage eight. This is literally, no, it's engage seven. Engage all seven inches of my cock into your mom's asshole. That's my ball. Would have been a bad interception, actually. Would have been an arm punt interception. He's gonna quit now. He does not play this out. This will be a Pierce conceded the game. Especially if I throw a spicy hot dot on him right now. Especially if I put Steve Smith on a deep corner route, put Tory Holt on a smoke screen, and absolutely just rammed this on him. One, two, you're you're done for. Five nine Steve Smith. Oh! Guys, I tried to I tried to telegraph all of it. Who's gonna step up and make this play? Shamir. I'm going back to the inside zone. There it is. There it is. No! I'm gonna get Jameer Gibbs a poverty reception and potentially a touchdown. What are you yapping about? Oh, laser! Steve! Whoa! That was literally 100% a drop. 100% that was a drop. He's trying to challenge the play and now he quits. That was a drop! Bro, I had the ball for like two seconds! Not even, bro, I had the ball for like 0.2 seconds. You know what, honestly, who knows? What is an NFL catch anymore? Does anybody know what constitutes an NFL catch? Oh my god, that is so funny. Alright guys, I can't play anymore. We, we have gone too deep down the rabbit hole of Wheel of Mutt games. We forced a lot of rage quits, but honestly, they're just, they're so early, they're so quick in these games that are very winnable by my opponent that I don't like taking a spin on the rage quit wheel. That game was a true rage quit though. Like, I really should. Good, but I don't know. Our team's already so good. I'm gonna take one more Ultimate Legends pack. If I pull something insane, I earn it. If I get nothing, I get nothing. Get Edger and James. We get 87 Darren Woodson. And oh my God, are you serious? It's actually such a good pull on a player I don't need. Who I already have. Gentlemen, this was an absolutely insane episode. You got three games worth of gameplay, which technically was like one game worth of gameplay. But all it means is we have been dominant this whole season. And all we need to do is carry this dominance into the the wild card. Here's our team going into the wild card. Insane offense, 94 overall. Insane defense, 94 overall. Don't you dare say a thing about Pete Werner, bro. That boy is goaded. All right, gentlemen. Texans season has been a movie. Five and zero. Oh. The next game is the wild card playoff. Wish me luck, boys. I love you. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.